In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to fix Fortnite not launching on an Xbox Series S. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I want to present multiple easy to follow steps to help you address any issues that you are having with Fortnite not launching on your Xbox Series S. So, usually this issue is going to be attributed to the installation of Fortnite on your Xbox Series S. The first thing that I would recommend before you even start all of this is that you visit the Epic Games support page and you check to see if the Fortnite servers are down. Usually if the servers are down, no one is going to be able to connect. So if you have friends who are playing as well, you can talk to them, see if they are able to connect. And if all of them aren't able to connect, then all of you simply have to wait until the servers are back up. Now, if you notice that the game and the servers are up, and when you try to launch it on your Xbox Series S specifically, it just closes down instantly, then like I said, it is going to be attributed to the installation of the game on your actual console. To figure out what's wrong, the first thing that I would recommend is that you go over to your library, select Fortnite, and you will find the option to manage the game. In there, select the option to manage the files of the game. Now, you will be able to find two relevant options to managing the installation. You will see the updates option and then the saved data. The first thing that you have to ensure is that there are no pending updates. So go over to update, see if you can force the game to check for updates. If you are running an outdated version of the game, you will not be allowed in. Since it is an online game, mostly, everyone needs to be running the latest version of the game. If you are running an outdated version, you will have to go through the update process. And of course, you need to ensure that you have enough storage space available on your Xbox Series S. As long as you choose the option for update, it is going to check for any pending updates. And if it detects that there are pending updates, they are going to go through right away. After you are done updating the game, try launching it again. If you notice that even after updating it doesn't work, or if there were no pending updates, but the game still doesn't work, then what you can try to do instead is clear the save data. Try once more, and if it still doesn't work, then as a last resort, I would recommend uninstalling the game completely and reacquiring it. Doing a fresh installation of the game is going to make sure that no files were corrupted during any possible updates or installations, and you will be good to go. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix Fortnite not launching on the Xbox Series S. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.